Well, good morning, friends. I am here on the dock this morning. It is Friday morning. Woo -woo, time for the weekend. And I, uh, it is also, uh, yeah, I got my half glasses on because I'm happy all the time. They used to say happy St. Patrick's Day. But I took the St. Patrick's off because we're happy all the time. Just me being me, you know. But today, St. Happy St. Patrick's Day. So at least we still got the greens. We're sporting the green. I won't get pinched. Um, and and a little uh, something. I don't know a lot about St. Patrick's. I did read it over the years, you know, um, about his life. But one thing I one my takeaway was anybody who gets snakes off an island is okay by me. <laughs> so so uh, yeah. So uh, I will celebrate that. <laughs> And then the second thing is I am down at the dock and we've had like, I know we've been talking about like some of the storms that have been coming through. Some of you guys have been calling me, checking on me, making sure everything's okay. Thank you. Give a look. And during this time, like when was it? Today's Friday. So it must've been like Tuesday. I drove around town and I was like astonished at how many trees were down. Like everywhere you turned. I mean, I started taking pictures because at one point I'm like, oh my gosh, like this, is this normal? And like, why are these trees, like in certain areas, it didn't make sense. Like, how did that thing become uprooted? And why just that one in the middle of all these other ones? So I started like paying more attention the more I started seeing stuff down. So today, that's what I wanted to just like highlight because um, the storms are coming, my friends. The storms are here. Some storms have passed and we've made it through. More storms will come because that's kind of how life is in this wonderful 3D world. <laughs> and so with that, we need to be readied for the storm. So let me just tell you about that. So um, when we went through a couple days without power, right? What is that old saying? Uh, it wasn't raining when Noah built the ark. Yeah, so actually I was texting one of my friends. I'm like, okay, the ark's built. And he's like, what do you mean? That means I went shopping. I got my water. I got my tuna. I got my peanut butter. I got my crackers. I got what will sustain me. Got some soup. If I have to go die hard, eat it cold out of can, we could do that. I got my charcoal and my lighter fluid. Like I built my ark, right? So, so we want to be prepared. Uh, three little pigs. The story of the three little pigs. They all wanted to build something, but not everyone wanted to invest in their future their future good and so some of them just wanted to live for the minute have go play they didn't want to just they didn't want to work so they're like whatever's around let's just make it with whatever is around and then we can go play make it fast make it easy yeah let's get some straw all right well I don't want to be spending all my money just building the house can we meet somewhere in the middle let's get some sticks and then that they're little, had to get the bricks and, which are more expensive, and take the time and the effort and the sweat. Because, you know, that's a lot of work. You ever mix cement? Woo! That'll give you a nice uh, bicep. Speaking of a nice bicep. Yeah, so, that'll give you a good bicep. <coughs> so, the three little pigs, they all built a house, but only when the storm came, when the big bad wolf came, only one of them stood. And it's the same way with foundations, and it's the same way with being rooted. We have to have a root system that goes down. I love the analogy of the palm tree because the palm tree goes down. Its roots go down and it wraps around the rock because the storms will come. But when the storms come, they bend but don't break and they withstand the storm. And that's how we want to be. So that's just the encouragement for the morning. We're here on this beautiful dock here. And I hope that you guys have a great and glorious, love-filled and victorious, beautiful weekend. And um, enjoy the sunshine while it's here. That's it for now. Have a great and glorious one.